Yeah, you. Over here. Did Agent Beatmaster send you? I thought he did. Today we're going to be making secret spy musical instruments. But I'm going to need you to echo some music patterns in order to enter the workshop. All right. You can use your hands or sing the words with ba, ba. All right, here we go. On my drum. Very nice. The next one's on the shaker. This is the real test. You are ready to make your mystery musical instruments. All right, secret spy agents, we are in the workshop and we're ready to make our musical instruments. Before we do that, I wanted to introduce myself. My name is Miss MJ and I am a musician, a teacher, and a creative, and I'm so excited to create these musical instruments with you. As you've seen before, we're gonna be making a drum today, and we're going to be making an egg shaker. So for the drum, here are the supplies you're going to need to make your drum. You're going to need some paper or a magazine. You're gonna need a container that you have at home, maybe something that you're getting rid of. We've got, I've got my oatmeal container here, or you can use a yogurt container, something that you can make into a drum, whatever size you like. You're also gonna need some glue and some tape. Make sure that your tape is packaging tape because it's gonna be really important that it's really wide tape so that we can cover the entire top of your drum. Okay, go ahead and go get those supplies and come on back and we'll be ready to make our drum. All right, now that you've got your supplies, we're gonna have you get out your container. Like I said, mine's an oatmeal container. This was also an oatmeal container, different sizes. You can get exactly what size you like. All right, you're gonna be using the packing tape, the extra wide kind to cover the entire top of your drum. So I'm gonna take my piece, I'm gonna go across the top, and right in the middle, just like that. And I'm gonna cut it nice and easy like that. So I've got my one piece going across the middle. Now I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna keep going with the tape on the one side. I'm gonna do two more pieces right here and right here, and then two more on the top to have the entire top covered in my packing tape. And this is gonna give us an awesome sound for when we play our secret spy themes at the end. Now the cool thing about a drum is that Drums were actually, the original drums were made with the skin of animals. So interesting. But today, we don't really do that, but um, we're gonna make kind of a layer that's going to work kind of like as a, a skin or rawhide would have used back in the day. All right, as you can see, I've got my entire oatmeal container covered at the top and it's going one direction. Now, we're going to go the opposite direction. So kind of like if you've ever seen uh, plaid or checkers, it's gonna go the opposite direction. So I'm gonna take mine, I'm gonna go across the middle and then go this way and then this way. Does that make sense? All right, you got this. Let's do this, spies. Going across. And just make sure you um, smooth out those edges. Smooth out those edges. And as you can see, it's kind of making a plaid formation. I'm gonna keep going. Remember two on the one side. Smooth it out with the tape. And then one more on this side. Smooth it out with the tape. And going to the opposite side. And don't worry about it if it looks like mine. 
where it's kind of built up on the sides, it's probably gonna do that and that's totally okay. I got my last piece to go here and I'm gonna smooth it out. Awesome, go ahead and hold up yours. Does it look like mine? Awesome. And you know, there's two layers here. I'm gonna need you to make four layers. So that means you're gonna do exactly what we did and you're gonna do it all again, two more times to make it nice and thick. But listen, actually sounds pretty cool. But this one I did four times. Just see if you can see the difference. Obviously the size is different, so it's gonna sound probably a little bit lower. Let's see. Yeah. So it's up to you. If you wanna do it two times, that's okay. This one I did four times. So you can go ahead and finish that on your own. All right, the next thing you're gonna do is decorate the sides of your drum. Unless you really like oatmeal, you can keep it like this and it'll work just fine. But it's more fun to make it your own and kind of be creative with it. So, um, and the best part about this project is that you can use everything that you have at your house. So um, I had to find some construction paper, which is great to use, but I also had this old magazine that I thought was really cool. And um, on the back, I found this spam picture that I thought would be a really cool background for this drum. So I'm gonna grab my glue. Did I mention you're gonna need glue? You're gonna need glue. This glue is actually really fun because it's disappearing purple. And I feel like this fits super well for our spy theme. All right, when you put it on, you're gonna see that it's purple. And then as it dries, the purple is going to disappear. So no one will ever know that you were using glue. Now that I got it nice and covered, I'm gonna go ahead and put it around my drum. Just like that. Now this piece of paper is actually kind of thick. So you may end up needing some tape to put it down. I think I'm gonna need some, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that. But you've got your packing tape right by you, so you can get a little more tape. Ooh. Looks like we, this disappearing glue has turned clear. Awesome. That side is ready. Makes a cool sound. Going to this side. Got my spam. I've actually never had spam. Have you guys? Hmm, I don't know. There we go. My drum right here, ready to play. Sweet, drum finish. The second instrument we're going to make is the egg shaker. I bet you're wondering, what is inside of this? How are we gonna make this sound? Well, all you're gonna need is some rice. And this, I just had this at home, so I'm gonna use the rice that I had at home. You could also use something like kitty litter, or maybe you have some lentils that you could find in the kitchen. Something to make something shake around, or maybe beads. That will work great. And you might notice this egg was from an Easter egg. So I've got a few Easter eggs that I have here from when it was Easter that will work perfect for your egg shaker, the rice, and then I'm gonna decorate mine with some stickers. So stickers are fun and make sure you have your packing tape close by to seal up your Easter egg. All right, so I'm gonna choose yellow today for my egg shaker. And I've got a little, little measuring cup here that I'm gonna get some rice out of my bag. And if you ever have something kind of tricky that you're working with, make sure that you talk to your mom or dad about helping you with it or before getting into it, just to make sure that mom or dad or your guardian knows that you're using some of the things and you don't make a huge mess. So 
I'm gonna reach in, get some of the rice. Got some in here. And you know, it's actually kind of cool when you put it in. It's gonna make a different sound depending on how much you put in. So I'm gonna actually dump it out a little bit just to show us what a little bit might sound like. And I'm not gonna tape it up right now, but I want you to just listen. Okay, so that's with a little bit. Let's see if we can put in, where's my scooper? Oh, it's in the bag. Put in a little bit more. So it's kind of just under. And this is kind of the bigger side. Let's we'll see what this sounds like. I think I like it better with a little bit less. Trying it like this. Let's see again. Yeah. But as a spy, you get to choose how much you want to put in and how you like the sound. Cool? All right, I'm gonna zip up my rice bag so it doesn't spill everywhere. I'm gonna put that to the side and I'm gonna get my packing tape. Packing tape, you're gonna use just little pieces. Now for the drum, we use some pretty wide, pretty long pieces. I want you to make sure you're just using, ooh, I'm gonna have to go back with this one. Mm-hmm. <laughs> There we go. All right. So with the with <clears throat> with the shaker, you're going to make sure that your tape is not so long, maybe about an inch. Go ahead and rip it there. And then you're going to tape your egg shaker shut. So, taping it like this, smoothing it out as you go. And I'm going to need two more to cover this entire one. You can also use scotch tape if you have that at home or masking tape or even like blue tape that you use for painter's tape. That could give it some fun color. So if you have anything like that, that would work great. So again, about an inch. I'm gonna start where I left off. I'm gonna connect the lines together. Sweet. I've got one more piece that I'm gonna need. I think this tape, the, pa the packing tape is pretty good because it's, it's gonna keep it nice and tight. So I would recommend that. So now you have your entire egg covered with tape on the middle seam so that nothing falls out. All right, and now I'm gonna have some fun with my stickers. And I did dinosaurs on this green one. So I think I'm gonna do my rocket ship space themed stickers. Got my rocket ship, put that right there. Ooh, I like the yellow with the flames. That looks cool. And I think I'll do one more. Can you name this planet? Saturn, right? Here we go, putting Saturn on the map, the shaker map. All right, spies, we now have our two instruments. We've got our drum and we've got our egg shaker, and it's time to make some music together. So, we're gonna be singing some secret spy theme songs. I'm gonna use this drum because I like it a little better, and I'm gonna use my original because that's what I practiced on for my spy songs. So, we're gonna start with the famous Pink Panther theme song. I don't know if you know this one, but I'm gonna sing it for you. It goes like this. But um, 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 cool. Well, we're gonna use both instruments. There's a drum part, just a simple. Can you keep that beat? And then your shaker is gonna kind of just be a real sneaky. Can you try that? Try the drum with me. Ready in. Cool, put that in our song while I'm singing the theme song, okay? We're gonna do the hit first on the drum. You might wanna have one hand on the drum, one hand on your shaker. Ready, here we go. Ba-dum, 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 ba-da-da-da-dum. Ba-dum, 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 ba-da-da-da-dum. Da, 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 
Sweet! We just did the Pink Panther theme song. Our instruments. Fantastic job. The next song we're gonna do is one from my childhood. It is Where in the World is Carmen San Diego? Um, so we're going to sing it together. Um, the first thing you're gonna need to do is just use your shaker. So you're gonna do the little beat on your shaker. Ba, 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 just like that. And then you're gonna hit your drum. You can put it down or you can do one hand. One, two, three, four, and five. Five hits in a row. Let's do that again. Ready, go. One, two, three, four, five. Awesome. We've got your shaker with you. And then we've got our drum for the very end. So it's gonna be just like this. And then we're gonna go. Where in the world is Carmen San Diego? That was our five hits. Okay, let's practice our five hits. Here we go. Where in the world is Carmen San Diego? All right, you ready with the shaker? One, two, here we go. She sneaks around the world from Kiev to Carolina. She's a sticky finger filter from Berlin down to Belize. She'll take you on a road on a slow boat to China. Tell me where in the world is Carmen San Diego? Tell me where in the world is Carmen San Diego? Sweet! Awesome! The last one we're going to do today is our Mission Impossible theme song. That's the one that goes like this. I'm sure you've heard it before. Cool? So what we're gonna do is two beats on the drum, two shakes. Cool, you got that? One, two, one, two, one, two. Great, are you ready for our last theme song together? Whew, all right, here we go. Two hits, one, two, and go. Yes. Wow, my spies, you guys have done an awesome job today creating our mystery musical instruments. Now, I'm handing off the mission to you to create your own spy theme songs. I have a feeling that Miss Sandra is going to be talking to you about creating your very own musical theme songs later this month. So be ready for that. All right, fellow spies, we have completed our mission today. I am so proud of you guys. Go ahead and go out and make your own music together with your friends or your family. Teach them some of the things that you've learned today, or maybe you could teach them how to create these instruments of their own. Before we go, we wanna thank the Grand Rapids Public Library Foundation that supports programs like this so that we can make special spy projects and do all kinds of other fun things this summer. So thank you, GRPL, and we will see you all later. Goodbye.